I'm Matt McNabb. I'm the director of Avita at Lyric Arts. I'm Chad Van Kekricks. I'm the scenic and lighting designer. What's fascinating about the show is, is that it's so much more than uh, a rags to riches story or a story of inspirational leadership or even a, a rock opera with, you know, really famous and memorable music. You know, there's a real, you know, darkness and controversy to Eva and Juan Perón and their leadership in Argentina at the time and a lot of, you know, failure and uh, just so much more than just this beloved person that we all think of when we think of Evita. She did nothing for years. So we talked a lot about uh, obviously capturing the setting is very important. Um, at the same time, it is highly theatrical. It's not all realistic at times. So we tried finding a very, very clear balance between very a lot of theatricality in the design of the show and a lot of research and a lot of practical uh, pieces that bring authenticity to the setting. Where the music of love's guitar is forever. There's such a, um, a time differential in the show. You start out in the present, you have to go back some 20 years and then work your way back to uh, that present day time. Uh, that you have all these settings, you can't add that sense of realism of each individual location. Uh, and that's why you kind of have to have that um, kind of a dramatic set. We talked a lot about the costumes and the props keeping us in the real world and the real story of the show and then the scenery and lights bringing that theatrical energy out of the score and the drama out of the, the story itself so we talked a lot, a lot about finding that that balance. that balance i hope when the audience leaves there's a discussion about if this person was wonderful or not and i hope that people disagree and i hope that it starts a conversation about it and i think that's what's exciting while you're watching it um, is this, this realization that this is so much more than an inspirational story of success.